Hi milkshakers, welcome to Jen's Jolly Bake. Before we start, make sure you wash your hands. Also, get a grown-up to help you. And if you're allergic to any of the ingredients in the recipe, make sure you swap it out to suit you. I'm going to show you how to make this delicious, cheesy garlic bread. It's perfect for sharing. You are going to need a loaf of bread like this. I haven't made it myself, I've cheated and I bought it from the supermarket, but feel free to make your own. You also need some chopped garlic and some mixed herbs and some olive oil and some chunks of cheese. Ask a grown-up to preheat the oven for you. I've got it on about 160 degrees. Now you need to get a grown-up to do the next part as well because it involves using a sharp knife. So ask the grown-up to make some lines in the bread, just like this. I'm gonna make, not all the way through though, to about halfway. So we're gonna go this way first. You need a nice sharp knife. And then this side too. Crumpled that side with my handprint. Whoops. It's all right, it'll spring back. more this way and then just turn it round and do exactly the same the other way so we're going to make lots of squares remember not to go all the way through oh oh and again and then turn it round start this way I think okay next should look a little bit like that. Next, what we're gonna do is we're gonna add the olive oil to the herbs. And the garlic as well, in there like that. Give that a good stir. And it should look a little bit like something like that. And we're gonna put this in between each of the lines. Oh, it smells delicious. Make sure you put it all the way in. Next, what you need to do is put your cheese in between the lines. So you could do this bit. Put the cheese in sections like this. Remember, it's going to melt, so it doesn't matter if it doesn't look very nice at the minute. It's going to look yummy when it comes out the oven. That's it, just stick them in like this. Doesn't matter if they poke out the top. Mmm! Why not? Do another one there. One more. That's it. And then we're going to pop this on a tray and put it in the oven until it's nice and golden brown and all the cheese is melted too. This has been in the oven for about 20 minutes and as you can see it's golden brown and all the cheese has melted. <gasps> Let's get stuck in! Hey! Save me some! Oh, hi milkshakers, I just finished watching Jen's Jolly Bakes and oh it was so delicious. Thank you for that Jen. Don't forget milkshakers to like, subscribe and click on the bell so we can let you know when there's more milkshake fun. Now take a look at this.